All right, so uh, we've got some questions from Jessica here that have been coming through, whether it's the gram, Facebook, emails, what have you. Um, so I'll try to address those. Uh, this is for Aero Rescue Challenge 2019. First question, uh, will CEUs be offered? I hope so. I mean, this is an unsanctioned event, but the quality of instruction, what we're going to do with the individual events and the Masters Challenge, yeah, it seems like a no-brainer. So we're going to fill out the uh, paperwork, send it into the ISA. So I would like to hope that there will be CEUs offered. Okay. Number two, when should volunteers arrive for setup? It's an easy one. On June 4th, I need my key personnel there at 10 o'clock. Okay. I'll let you know who you are, when you are, and what's going to happen. June 5th, 0700, all volunteers and techs. I want you there. We got a lot, to, a lot of work to do on the 5th of June because the event starts on the 6th, okay? Um, suggested best mode of travel to Bellingham. In my mind, it's way better to take the much cheaper flight to SeaTac if you're coming from the East Coast, South, Northern part of the United States and uh, get the airport or shuttle or rent a car, go where, whether you're going to camp or get a hotel room. Um, flying into Bellingham is much more convenient, but adds quite a bit of cost to your flight unnecessarily in my mind. So that's that. And those My brothers coming and sisters coming from our northern province in Canada, come across the border, you know what to do. Okay. Do we have a bunch of gear to use? Uh, bring your personal climbing kits. That's PPE and your standard climbing kits, whether you come from rope rescue, rope access, or arboriculture, don't care. Bring your standard kit. We will do a gear check, but we will also have equipment supply that will be absolutely necessary for the individual events as well as the masters. So, um, but again, I can't stress this enough. Bring your kit. The rules are simple here. Okay. Can the public spectate on the competition days? We are on a private piece of property, so we'll suss that out later. We'll see what happens regarding that. We could have a few people, you know, family, friends, that kind of thing. Um, but we'll see. Who are we competing with? Well, shit, each other. Uh, what are some of the prizes? We'll go into that in greater detail in another video. Uh, three disciplines of rescue, yes. Fire rope rescue, high angle rope rescue, you know, lump those together. Uh, industrial rope access and arboriculture, all right? All of the events that are going to happen are going to happen in structures that are trees, so living organisms. So everybody deal with it, okay? Is on-site camping, camping and parking spots limited? Yeah, to a degree, but we have enough room knowing who I know that's coming. You know, a lot of folks will be hoteling, motelling, um, but there are plenty of camping sites and plenty of parking, and we will work out a shuttle transportation system for those if we do run into that headache. We'll see what happens. Um, I think I hit everything. Yep, we're good to go. So again, Error Rescue Challenge 2019. Looking forward to seeing everybody there. This is going to be fun. Trust me on this, okay? <laughs>